Hey folks, I am Sumit from Backbench Coder. This is my first ever YouTube video, so I am quite nervous. Alright then, this is the final portfolio. This is an end-to-end -end product. We will be developing this product from wireframe to deployment. So let's explore this project. Uh, this is the sidebar and this is the main component. And then here this is your picture, it is your name and this is your tag web developer. And if you click on this download resume, it will download your resume and then you can see this is downloading and this is your facebook link this is your instagram link uh, this is a hard coded address and if you click on this github link it will uh, redirect you to your github account and this is a fun part if you click on this email me it will redirect you to your email app and uh, let's click on so max okay okay then see this two field is already filled up with code.sumax.gmail.com it is same as this code.sumax.gmail.com so this is a uh, i think this is a more more modern way to communicate with your client rather than creating a contact form like name email and description and all okay so this is the part where all the magic happens uh, this is a nav bar resume about and projects okay so let's talk about the about about section this is a little bit description about you and what you offer and again guys this is a single component and this is rendered multiple times using different props i'll be explaining every uh, single line of code in react and if you if i go to resume section and this is a beautiful resume section and see how this color matches with the background and then this is again a single component your skill and this is rendered with a different icon and different properties and if i go to the project section okay and i look at the scroll bar this scroll bar matches with the background color and looks beautiful and again this is a single component rendered multiple times that's the power of react right if i click on this project it will send me to the live version of the project and if i click on this link it will send me the github link of this particular project and then this is the nav bar look react.js is all the poem project using react.js in processing this is all the i mean projects using processing this is vanilla js this is the all and this project is responsive guys look at this this is from mobile phone and then this is a scroll bar and if i go for the excel 2 and if i go for the responsive okay look at this image resizing i'll be explaining every every bit of code guys and now this is not an absolute beginner's course and there is a few thing i would expect you to know which is uh, at least the basics of html css and javascript knowledge about npm like if you know the comments like npm start npm install that's enough yeah i would also expect you to know the basics of react things like what is component, how to create a component, how to create a react project using create react app and this is a wireframe part and I'll be explaining every diagram what it is and why this is used uh, when I should make it a component, what should be a component tree okay this is the main part uh, technologies we are going to use I'm going to use HTML, CSS of course and this is the HTML okay then for css i am using bootstrap 4 then javascript i am using react js 16 point uh, anything greater than 16 point 16 okay for external libraries i am using framer motion for a little bit of animation and react router react router to make this page a single page application if you see this page and look at this url how url changes um, but the page does not refresh right look at this about this is going to home page and again resume a resume page play about look at this this is made with react router and then yeah i'll be deploying this project in netlify this is a free platform and again guys this is not for completely beginners who does not know html css and little bit of javascript because i will not be explaining what is the what is h1 like what is background color and this all like if you are smart enough you will pick this there will not be any problem to learn html and css like now in the installing part like node.js npm npx and this little word um, git 
I don't want to waste time on this boring stuff. Like there are plenty of uh, plenty of articles out there in the internet, and you can check and install it. That's all. I'm I'm really hopeful you will enjoy the series, and I'm gonna see you in the next video. Thank you.